By the time I post this, it is November 6th and just 4 days to the release date of the Series X and so you might want to know what games you should pick up and play. Oh my god! Okay, it's happening! Everybody stay calm! What's the Everybody procedure, everyone? Calm. What's the procedure? Stay f***ing calm! Wait, 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 wait! Everybody are f***ing calm down! That's what this video is all about. Here are, in my opinion, the games that I'm most excited about and please do let me know what games you're gonna grab and play on the first day in the comments down below. Also, before we get started, I want to say that I put a lot of time and energy towards making these clips and it would mean a lot if you could smash that like, drop a comment, and subscribe. They're completely free to do and it would mean a lot to me. With that being said, let's dive straight into this video. To start the list off, we have Outriders, which is Square Enix's drop-in and drop-out multiplayer game that is far from the usual titles that they publish. The science fiction third-person shooter takes players into a planet full of hostile creatures, and I can't wait to see what comes of this game. Bright Memory Infinite is a game that really stands out for the Xbox Series X. Ever since its launch, it's been one of the best showcases of the next-gen power. The graphics are stellar using an Unreal Engine, but one thing to note is the interesting gameplay mechanics that mixes in first-person shooting with hack and slash elements. What's crazy is that this game is just made by one person, and this is one of those instances where the little guy is punching well above its level. This game is slated for release in 2021, but you will have the chance to play the first episode on launch day. Dirt 5 is coming out this 10th of November, and this is Codemasters' breathtaking racing title which aims to provide a more relaxed arcade racing environment compared to their previous sim racers. With the Series X's powerful SSD, you will race around in 120 frames per second, and with that massive 4K display, it definitely puts this on the list of games to look forward to. In Immortals Phoenix Rising, you get to play as Phoenix, a new winged demigod on the quest to save the Greek gods from the Dark Curse. Take on Mythical Beast, master the legendary powers of the gods, and defeat Typhoon, the deadliest titan in Greek mythology. This game is brought to you by the same developers of Assassin's Creed Odyssey, and they did take some inspirations for The Legend of Zelda The Breath of the Wild. So if you want the best of both worlds, this game seems very promising. If you are looking for a more AAA title with an expansive open world, then Far Cry 6 is the one for you. It is an upcoming first person shooter developed by Ubisoft Toronto with an amazing open world experience. Far Cry franchises are also a company with great stories and amazing villains. The story takes place in a fictional Caribbean island ruled by a fascist dictator who is guiding his son Diego who is unsure in his future to follow his footsteps. This title is delayed, uh, but this title is more than deserving to be one of the most anticipated games for the Xbox Series X, so do look out for it when it eventually um, comes out. Next on this list is Assassin's Creed Valhalla. Visually, it's breathtakingly beautiful, and you get to play as Ivor, a mighty Viking raider, and lead your clan from the harsh shores of nowhere to new home amid the lush farmlands of the 19th century England. You explore a beautiful, mysterious open world where you will face brutal enemies, raid fortresses, build your clan settlements, and forge alliances to win glory and earn a place in Valhalla. This is definitely a game that I'm going to be playing on launch day. Call of Duty is inevitably one of the largest game franchises out in the video game world as of current. And this one promises a complete package, an amazing multiplayer experience, compelling single player campaign, and a zombie mode. As a bonus, Call of Duty Cold War will be in 4K resolution in 120 frames per second. So yeah, if your TV is capable of 120 hertz, you will be able to experience an incredibly smooth first person shooter. Yakuza Like a Dragon is a huge surprise for the Xbox fans because pretty much Yakuza has been a PlayStation only exclusive franchise until recent years. But somehow, Xbox managed to get Yakuza 7 as next generation timed exclusive for the Xbox Series X. 
Many Xbox fans are not aware of this title, but this franchise is one of the best stories hands down, so do check this out when it comes out for the Xbox Series X. Medium is a psychological horror thriller game exclusive for the Series X, played in third person as Marianne, a medium who can travel into the spirit realm. This game will remind you of the old Resident Evil and Silent Hill games with similar fixed camera angles, but what stands out most is how you can play in two separate dimensions at the same time. This game has a lot of potential for clever gameplay, and so let's see what becomes of this. Cyberpunk 2077, after being on works for almost 10 years and being pushed to a later December 2020 release, this is one of the most anticipated games cross platforms, promising a massive open world that actually looks interesting to explore. One of the issues with expansive open worlds are that sometimes they may appear to be empty, not having a lot of things to explore, but you can actually tell the developers put a lot of thought to create this very futuristic city with a lot of opportunities for exploration. Along with this amazing atmospheric world, the game also promises an amazing RPG experience with a strong story. To put it simply, imagine a futuristic Grand Theft Auto with RPG elements. The good news is, when Cyberpunk 2077 does come out, it will look and play best on the Xbox Series X, thanks to smart delivery technology on the Xbox Series X. Hope you guys enjoyed this video and if you enjoyed this video, please do show some love to this video by smashing a like as well as sharing this video around helping this video be spread across new audiences. And if you like what we do on the channel, please also smash the subscribe button, all of this is anonymous, so completely free for you guys and it's a tremendous busy help for the growth of my channel. Uh, and we will see you guys next Friday, thank you so much.